Hi, I'm Michaela Yu. Hi, I'm Genesis Munoz. Hi, my name is Lucy Mendez. Hi, I'm Kendra McNall. Hi, my name is Brooklyn Folk. Hi, I'm Alize Schaefer. Hi, I'm Gracie Foley. Hi, I'm Lily Kilburn. And I'm Chantel Snyder. And welcome to the Cardinal Couch. Here we will be reporting the weather, teacher interviews, student polls, star study, and more. First, let's go to Genesis for the weather. Thank you, Lily. We will be experiencing sunny days with some rain. So make sure to bring coats and umbrellas. It is likely to be in the 40s and 50s in this week. Over the next few hours, it will be cloudy with winds up to 10 miles per hour. Back to Lily and Chantel on the Cardinal Couch. And that was the weather from Genesis. Now let's go to Kedja for the teacher spotlight. Ms. Hall, what's your current position at Cardinal Park? I am a fifth grade teacher. Ms. Hall, where are you from? I'm from Springfield, Illinois. If you had an opportunity, what profession other than education would you like to attempt? I've always wanted to one day open a coffee shop, be an entrepreneur, own my own business, run it. Um, I love coffee and I like talking to people. What is your favorite food? Tacos, 100%. And the nachos and the chips and the salsa and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. Do you have a favorite quote or saying? My favorite quote is by Abraham Lincoln. He has a lot of good quotes. Mm -hmm. um, my favorite is, I don't like that man. I must get to know him better because it helps me go through life um, meeting new people and how I should treat people. Thank you so much for taking the time to chat with us, Ms. Uh, just another day in the life. Back to you, Lily. And that was the teacher spotlight from Kendra. Now let's go to Allie, Michaela, and Delina for the star students. Today we're interviewing Jack. Are you, what's the secret to being a star student? Being kind, being brave, helpful, doing the right thing. Are you excited to be a star student? Yeah. So today we're interviewing for the second grade star student. Okay. Are you, what's the secret of being a star student? Being good. Are you excited that you got a star student? Yes. Thank you. Okay, so today we are interviewing Kim, and she is in second grade. What First. is the secret of being a star student? Being a good listener, helping out, and just being good. Uh, are you excited that you got a star student? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Today we're interviewing Emily for the second grade star student. What are the secrets of being a star student? You have to be kind. Don't be rude to other people. Don't be rude. Were you excited that you got to our student? Yeah. Today we're going to be interviewing Tad. What grade are you in? Second. He's a second grade star student. What are the secrets of being a star student? Kind, honest, uh, good citizenship. Were you excited that you got some And those were the star students. Great, Great job, job, kids. Now let's go to Camp Little Rock with Maya and Gracie. What's your name? My name is Mrs. Fulton. Have you, I have noticed that your room is different. What's going on? We have been enjoying Camp Learn a lot this week because we completed our iRead testing. So we are celebrating. How was your first experience when you did, when you first did camp learning? It was crazy for me, but I think the kids enjoyed it. So the first year I did it was when you were in third grade. And uh, did you enjoy it? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. And it was only one day. So this year we had some cancellations and some crazy stuff. So we did it for the whole week and parts of the day. Um, so hopefully they enjoyed it too. How long did you do camp learning? This year we did it for um, a whole week. Last year was just one day, and then the year before that was just one day. So I've been doing it for three years, my third year. <clears throat> Why do you have a camp? Oh, a tent in your room? Because you can't go camping without a tent, right? And so some, some of our friends have never been in a tent before. 
or they've never slept in one, so at least this is as close as they can get is to being one in the classroom. How did you come up with Camp Fire? I saw some teachers were doing it online, and um, I was like, oh my gosh, that is so awesome! So I went out and bought a tent. Boy, camp learn a lot. I like it. Do you guys like it? Yeah. Camp learn a lot? Yeah, yeah, I think it's fun. I love camping. We go camping every year, so um, it's fun to bring that into the classroom. How's Camp Learn a Lot going? Well, it's been crazy. School cancellation yesterday, and we had rescheduled it once before, but um, the kids are really enjoying it. Do you have stations? Yeah, we call them campsites. And um, so there are five campsites in my classroom and there are five campsites in Mrs. Wiggins' classroom. So almost every other um, station or rotation, they go from one room to the other room, so they kind of switch. That's pretty nice. Yeah. What subjects do you do? We do all the subjects in Camp Learn A Lot. So um, sometimes they're doing writing or they're doing dictionary skills for reading. Um, they are planning a camping trip, and I think you probably did that, or it was one of the stations when you were here. Um, and they have to use math and visit different websites to find different camping supplies. Um, so we hit all the different subjects. That was Camp Learn a Lot. Cool, right? And that was the Cardinal Couch. Hope you enjoyed. See you next time. Bye.